Hello. All right, Dad. How are you doing? You all right? Yes. Please allow me the joy of introducing myself. Please, Paul. Note that if you disrupt the blue beam, all right, you're going there. Right, hello everyone, my name is Eselfax, and I'd be delighted to welcome you to this quantum conundrum. The c conundrum of the quantum... quantox... No, the qu quantiniums. Right. Is that what we're doing? Well, it's a puzzle-based game. I'll do the and, and do the puzzle seesaw. Oh, I am doing. Look at me. Look at me solve the tricks. Oh, it's all gone floaty balls. Yep, yes, that's right. It's very interesting for everyone. Go on then, Dad. Begin you. Fifty-two part. Thank you. Oh. Right, well, I'd like to thank the Obscure Picasso again. Oh. Oh, Dad is stupid. That's not supposed to happen. Shut up. That's counting down. Carry on. Yes, I'd like to thank the Obscure Picasso again for purchasing this game. Whoops. A long time ago now, and we've only just had a chance to get round to playing it, haven't we, Paul? Yeah, ah, oh, shitty piss. Uh, use your cognitive processes and solve the problem. Well, they're all right, shush. Yes, I'd like to say thank you, Ob Obscure Pickers. Sorry it's taken so long to uh, to get round to playing in it. What does that do? Oh, hello. Oh! That frightened me, Dad. I was a bit... Scared? Oh, thunk. Yes. Well, it's all right. You're allowed to be frightened, Paul. You're a delicate little flower. Thank you. That's right. I am. Shit, what am I doing? Oh, I don't know. What have you done? That steps out. Get off me. But then there's this burning. Ah, oh, sh. It's too confusing, Paul. Is you're not kidding there, old biddy boy? So, what's happening? There's something there. I don't know what. Why not, man? Sounds like the phone's ringing, Dad. You stupid! It's not ringing, Paul. Sorry, sorry for that silence, viewers. Um, I thought the phone was ringing, but it wasn't. I'm not entirely sure how many BEDs of radiation mm. that emits. Hope you're not looking to have children. I was looking to have children later. Um, that's not going to happen, is it? Oh, that'd be ridiculous. Um, voiced by Q from Star Trekkingtons. Oh, what do we do? I hit thinking. It's just like, I hate it. Makes my, my mind go special. Yeah, so you're not used to using your brain, of course. I failed all my GCSEs, of course. That's well documented now. Well documented. How do I get that man to be that there? Fluffy. Uh, fluffy pants. Note Put that. that if you oh, shut your face, Q. Q. Ah, oh, but... People don't want to watch you struggling with us for half an hour, Paul. Right, and then you just stay there. Well, that's what they're going to get, Cecil, if they, wa if they watch the rest of this video. It'd be me. Going, oh, I do, I do. Oh, I do this. Oh, right. I get you now. That's what you do, ladies and gentlemen. That's what you do. I want to kick its eyes off. Ah! 
think it hurt me. That's it when it's in fluffy. That's it when it's in normal. And that's it when it's in the heavy dimension. Yes. I don't give a crap. I wish he'd shut up. On and on he babbles. Cute Star Trek's for nerds. Don't you badmouth Star Trek, Paula. Bloody love it. Bloody love it. Escapism. Mm. Mm. It's not real, this, though. So. Of course it's not bloody real. Oh, shit. What's that? Never said it was real. Yes, you did. What do I do? Oh, oh thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, thank you. I get an out to me now. I do. I get it. I'm smart, so I'm using my book smarts that I got from looking at a magazine once. Right, what magazine was, oh, what magazine was this? Dogs and Frogs Monthly. Oh! Yep. I found it very interesting. <laughs> Reading about the various kinds of dog and frog are related news. Right. Sounds fun, where did you get that from, Paul? Um. My friend Eugene, he had it on his kitchen table. Um and he just I just I looked through it. I told you not to go messing around with that Eugene Paul. He's not right. It might not be right, Cecil, but it's he's got some good magazines. Uh, oh shit. Don't want you messing around with that boy. That boy's in his forties. That's a boy to me, pal. Steady. Steady on Cecil. That's it in normal. That's it in light. That's it in heavy. Oof. It's gone like a gothic. Oh, hello, laser beams. Laser beams of fun and joy. And songs of joy and tears of laughter is all we need to lift our hearts. Is it? Yes. Right. Well, I'll, I'll, uh, I'll think about that then, Cecil. It looks so cozy over there. Then it's a frigging cozy. Excuse me. Oh, my puzzles. <laughs> I find the number three to be a very satisfying number. It's a right. number. Did it not, lad? It's not nearly enough. Not nearly enough. Bless him enough. Stop doing that, you stupid bastard. Hey, says. Says, says so. No, no. Come, come. Oh, shit. This might not be the longest gaming video we've ever, ever done. I said, you're not helping me at all, so I said, just sat there, looking stupid, if I might be so honest as to say. Can I do that? Um. Oh, freaking hell. What are you looking at, you one-eyed freak? Eh? Don't want no cyclops gawping at me. What are you looking at? Uh, shit, I'll have you. Oh, maybe not. I'm a bit scared of robots, Cecil. So they frighten me a little bit. No, they. Yeah, I, ju I just said they did. I just said that. Oh, it's sticking its, oops, sticking its tongue out at me. Oh, that's gone. Oh! Yeah, you do that, lad. What do I do? How can I stack to one there? Boom! Idiot! Ma. 
find the number three to be a I found the number three to be a number. And the problem is that How do I do it, Cecil? Get on top and wriggle around a bit. Sorry? Oh, uh, never mind, Paul. Misheard you. Mm -hmm. Oh, you heavy bastard. You heavy bastard. What good's that gonna do if you get them all through there? No, no. Oh, oh, I know what I can do with this. I've used my mind. I've used it. Uh, 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 uh. Uh. Stop it. You stop it, stupid old man. Oh, you friggin' bastards. Paul! Sorry. Sorry, sorry, sorry. No, what you doing? A disobeying a direct order from you, the general. Oh, come on to me now. Ahem, <laughs> hum, scot free. Oh, piss off. Piss off, Q. Cubit from Cubit the game. No one will get that, Paul. No one knows what games. Oh, I couldn't give a shit. This is my ice gun. Freezy Ray Vaughn. Ha 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 ha! Paul, players! Oh, I really wish I could do that. You talk more about stats. What the f. Oh. This is a compression platform, which you You're a compression platform, you ass head. Like a spring, the energy pulses below the platform excite oh. the molecules oh. in the air, stimulating an elastic structural release. This is blah 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 blah. That's what I think when people talk about science, Cecil. I don't know it well enough. I bloody did our bit of it. So rude to me. You're rude, rude to me, Cecil. I'm gonna stand on this sudden box if it kills me. I might kill you tonight, you little shit. Such a... Come here to me. Get on the uh, bastard box. Why? What? What? No. Oh, Paul, this is shit. You're not saying anything. I can't too fix this. I can't think about. Oh, we don't like that. I don't like having me on it. Well, who would? Um, Claire Rayner. What she? I don't know. She might do. She might do so. I very much doubt that, Paul. But you never know. I might write to her and ask her. Me? Oh well. Now you know. Now you know. No, no, no. Cubit. Paul, I'm, I'm bored to death watching you play this game. I'm so oh, shit. I'm sorry, but you're boring me today. I bloody it off. Well, how does one go about opening this then? Hmm. What would you like me to do? Oh, you f oh, I'm going to punch it, Cecil. I'm going to punch it right in the bosom. You're not. Checkpoints. Checkpoint Charlie, Cecil. What does that mean? Um. I don't know. I bet you're old, Cecil. You're supposed to know. Uh, whimp. Flying through the air like a gibbon in a wind tunnel, splatting on the end and bursting on my guts. Now I <laughs> see a giant pit filled with keys. 
But I've had enough, Cecil. I feel a bit sick. Oh. Well, despite Paul's affluence. It's not the right word, Cecil. Indifference. Paul, I would like to thank Obscure Pixie again for this delightful fun game. You need enough change in the mass to build I'm going to change his mass into a out of work actor. You're not Paul. I'll piss on it. I'm going to piss on it. So I'm going to do. Ow. Oh. 